gorgeous ladies and gentlemen of the realm, Fairy Vixen here, back again with another video, and the last one didn't take, and I was just putting things, sorting them, so, um, we are done, the box, the metal box, here is the best thing that I found in that bunch, uh, these are Amrita Singh, Elephant earrings. Very cool. And I also found this. Uh, it's kind of strange. He's digging a hole. And he's got angel wings. And he's got a hat on. And this is Zirkus. Z-I-R-K-U-S. Or Zirkus. So I'll be looking that up. And a bunch. <laughs> a whole bunch. Oh, I found a, a blitzy glitzy ring. And you know how I always put things on while I'm making them. There's a red howlite and a lapis. And we had finally gotten to all of these cool things for the craft lot that uh, I believe is going to go to Susan Gill. So, oh, there's your bump. Hopefully, uh, I put it on airplane plane mode, so it should go well. Um, sorry if my hands are dirty. Um, kind of was digging through, you know, how it goes when you're digging through the, the little bits at the bottom. Um, what else? Oh, a whole pile of wine glass thingies. So, if you drink wine and you have your friends over, well, we're not doing that right now, but, you know, when there's not a pandemic, if you are a wine drinker that likes to have friends over for your wine and cheese or whatever, let me know. I got 80 bajillion of them now. Um, <laughs> don't know how they all ended up in the jewelry thing, but, um, okay then. What we're going to start next, I have another lot. One, two, three, four, five, five, one, two, three, four, five, six. Another six box lot that I'm not going to get into right now. I have a one box lot that was between the two the this last one that I just finished and that one and it was a box of his better stuff or what you know he pulls for his booth that he thinks is better stuff sometimes it is sometimes it isn't so we're gonna do that box next um so let's get started and I'll be yammering at you while we do it of course as usual but these these are cool these are Amrita Singh and uh, they're post and they're brass and they have little red eyes and they have the trunk up for good luck so those are cool I'm gonna put them over here okay now I have not opened this box yet oh wait 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 a minute I could show you something else between them you remember how I said I had a whole bunch of belts let me show you well you remember this from Two, two videos ago. This is the one with the, it's kind of ratty, that one, but, you know, you know, they don't last forever. Oh, there's another bump for you. Okay, so, if anyone is interested in these belts, let me know. This one, and this one with the big hoops, and these are all, you know, reasonably small so I don't know what you would do with them but here's another one this is a little longer and it's got links like this that oh come on flip over like that and then at the end it's got a bigger one and a tassel and then it's got a hook. Here's the hook at the other end. Like that. <sighs> okay. And here is a faux tortoise shell one with silver in between. This has a name on it even. What do you say? You say made in Italy. This is Italian. And it is um, what do you say? 
uh, I don't know, 18, what, B, no, B-I, B-I something, B-I, B-I-T-Z, bits, B-I-T-Z, bits, so that has a brand name on it, I've never heard of that name, but it's this on the end, and it's that. Okay, and this is a nice one that is wood and chain. It's a real nice one. It's got some. That one's a little bigger. And it's another one that has this kind of a so you can you can do it anywhere along the chain. That one, there's a purse chain. I get so many purse chains too. I'm sure you do too. It's these kind. That and that. And this one's broken, so we're going to pull that. Unless, well, I don't know, if you want a nice heavy chain for something, maybe we'll put that in the craft lot. Yeah, yeah that'll go in the craft lot. Here's a big one, silver tone, very lightweight, it's got this kind on it, and then it also has a little blingy, blingy ringy. This one is very small, black leather, and a flat figaro. That is like a kid's belt. It's, if you're really tiny, that'll work. Here's an elongated, um, what do you call it, a Gucci chain or something. This. Yep, yep. That. And here is a big old plain chain one. with one of these on the end and one of these quite quite long Oops. well it seems like it's quite long oh it's one of those ones from the 80s with the it goes to a double swag yeah that it goes on the side you remember those? <laughs> and this one, I think it's the same thing. It has this at one end. And then it's plain one chain, and then it goes to two chains. So you hook it to the two chains, and you wear the two chains on the side. So, that's my pile of fashion metal belts. If anyone is interested, please let me know. Because I don't know what the heck I'm going to do with them. I'm pretty sure that they're not going to do the town-wide yard sale this year, year because... Keep bumping me, sorry. Because it's in April, and it's coming up fast. So I'm pretty sure we're all still going to be on lockdown at that point. So, boo hoo. I will wash everything. Everything, everything, everything. Everything that goes out the door will be thoroughly washed before it leaves my house. <coughs> um. <coughs> yeah, okay. God, I got a, um, I'm kicking up dust trying to clean. I'm allergic to dust. <laughs> and I'm not going to open this. This is from my stepdaughter. Um, I just dumped the bag in here and took out the trash, the object trash. 
Um, and it smelled really musty when I opened it, so I'm not going to do that. Since the dust is already bothering me, I'm not going to do that one. So let's break into this new box of his, quote, better stuff. Cut into it. Mm. It looks pretty. It looks pretty. We're at 10 minutes already. I didn't think it'd take 10 minutes to do those belts. Ugh. Oh my god. That's adorable. I'm already seeing stuff I like. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Cute stuff. Okay. Here is a really nice glass bracelet. Red faceted glass. That is gorgeous. Oops, I'm gonna get a new back box here. <laughs> So today, went to the grocery store, and it was positively apocalyptic in there. It was so bad that I had a <laughs> had a crying fit because um, it was just so scary. There's a snowflake obsidian heart. Very nice. Um. But yeah, there was no meat. Pink cat's eye. There were no canned goods. 49ers. Anybody a 49ers fan? Because I'm not. And that's kind of specialized. So. <laughs> Let me know. I'll send it to you for free. Um. Oh, look at the little bicycle. The frozen foods were completely empty. The bread aisle was completely decimated. Speaking of the bread aisle, this is on raffia, which I think is a crying shame. This is all um, very nice uh, banded agate. Very cool. But that's not going to stay on there. Not if I can help it. Um, yeah, so. Well, this is nice. Ebony and silver. It's got some missing. I'm pretty sure it had something attached to it there. That's different. So, yeah, it was, um, very disheartening. We had to go to three stores to get two weeks worth of uh, groceries. Normally, I go once a week, um, but I decided to do a two-week. But I won't do that again. I'll just continue to do a one-week because uh, the governor is shutting us all down on Tuesday, and grocery shopping is all you're going to be allowed to do. Now, my dumb luck... Uh, my boys, my hub, hubby, and, and, yeah, we, uh, they're both, um, look at this tiger eye, so pretty, it's got a magnetic, looks like a frying pan, is that a frying pan clasp? Anyway, yeah, they're both essential. One's at a gas station, which is great because he can, they can close the doors and just use the window, which is great. And the other one is, works at Pep Boys because they have a government contract to repair government vehicles. Um, but they are kind of closing to the public. And they're not letting, if anybody comes in off the street, they're not letting them pass the registers. It's just parts only. So they come in, they say what part they want, and they get the part and hand it to them, and that's basically it. And they pay for it and go. So I'm not too worried. Um, 
and I'm also keeping scrupulously clean except when I'm doing these stinking videos I am going to chop my nails off so that it is easier to keep my hands completely clean um, even though I don't go out uh, you can call me paranoid um, yeah I'm completely paranoid Ooh, look at this crystal it's a big crystal oh, look at the rainbow is there rainbows is it going to show me rainbows yeah you can tell there's a little rain I can see the rainbows. Every one of these little things has a rainbow in it to my screen, my eye. So, this is spiny oyster? No, it's just beads. I don't know what this is supposed to be, but it's interesting. Anyway, while I was in the grocery store, we were walking around and we had... This is cool. We were looking at the Atkins because I'm on a special diet, which is even, makes it even harder to grocery shop. But anyway, we were in the Atkins part, and, um, ooh, this is pretty. And the, um, that's gorgeous. The bread aisle was right next door, so we heard a girl say, Mom, one or two. One loaf or two. Oh, this is a Monet. Very nice. And her mother says to her, Two. I don't give a F about any of these people. So, of course, I had to start crying again. Because people, people are so mean. People are so selfish. They don't think about any... Well, they do. They think about other people, but it's, you know... Who gives it about other people? I mean, I can't, I can't for the life of me. Cannot for the life of me figure out how you can be that way. Like, I don't give a F about any of these people. And what do you do if somebody, you know, somebody carrying the virus says that? Like, what if the next person that she was near had it and gave it to her because they didn't give a F about anyone? Ugh, it just made me so angry. It made me so angry, I cried. And if I don't shut up, I'm going to cry again. But this whole thing is getting getting out of whack, man. It's getting crazy. This looks like an alpaca. Like, it's a double... A du you know how they do the twisted ones? This looks like a double, like a double twisted one. And I don't, I can't see, I don't see a mark on it anywhere. But yeah, I'm doing my best to try to keep calm and going out in public today was really a shock. Especially, especially when people are talking like that and just don't care. Here's a nice cloisonne bracelet. And a pretty green one, I don't have any green ones. But yeah, I just, I hope everybody out there is staying safe, staying inside. Um, if you don't have to be out anywhere, don't be. That's interesting. Brass. It's small, but it's, it's really smooth. It's kind of nice. I like it. There's no name on it. It's kind of neat. But, um, but yeah, you kind of have to wonder about people, you know? It's like, Rocini, look, they're little, they're little tulips, they're little purple tulips. Rocini, well, we'll see what that is. But made in Taiwan, which means they're vintage. That's kind of neat. Um, Oh, so cool. It's a lady's bolo tie. Or a man's, I guess. A rose and a boot and a little star spur. And dun dun dun. It needs an end. Hopefully we find an end. 
Um, so I got home and I started cooking because we got finally got everything we needed. Look at this tiger eye and hematite. Look at that. Look at the layout on that. Isn't that cool? This part's a little worn because it's just painted steel, but that looks really cool on all that. Ouch. Peachy. Ouch. <laughs> Didn't get it on fast enough. That's cool. Doesn't really go with uh, the Monet, but. <laughs> So yeah, I've been cooking since I got home. I'm making an Indian dish. So when I'm done doing this, I gotta go back to that. This is neat. Little marquees, look. Little marquees guy. He fits nice. It's one of these kinds. Oh, there's a bump. Another bump. Bumpity bumpity. Here is some jade and some pearls. It's one of these old fashioned y kind of claspuses. And I think the clasp is 9 to 5. I don't know. I look. Yes. Gold plated. 925. So it's white gold plated sterling. That's a nice one. Very nice. Let's get it back. Put it back together. So yeah. Today was a crazy day. I did did I already say it? I can't remember half the stuff I said already. Oh, this is how frazzled I am. And I laid in bed last night for four hours having um, palpitations, which is no good. I don't really want to have those right now. Here's a nice wide cloisonne. Kind of cool. Like a copper color. Uh, what the heck? What the heck is this? What is that? What is that? If anybody knows what this is supposed to be, let me know. It's on a chain. It's crazy looking. Here is a... Crane earring. I'm pretty sure that is plastic. It's very shiny. Oh, might be shell. Well, it's hard to tell, but. He's different. Ooh, look at this guy. Very steampunky. Brass and silver with like a a green wash on it. Book chain. I have to scrub that and see if the green comes off. We shall see. Ooh. Mother of Pearl with so many rainbowy colors in it. So nice. Pretty. Here is a. Ooh, I like the clasp on that. What does the clasp say? It says M S I L. Silver. Come on, do we have, can we, uh, it doesn't have it on here, it has it on the back, it has black and white pearls, 
and they feel like the real deal to me so the whiter ones I can't tell what they are but the black the black is Tahitian very heavy very nice black and white I like it Ooh, we're at 25 already Lord Lord of mercy and this is a Tigger Tiger, Tigger Tiger, not a Tiger. It's a Lipog. And it looks like it's a Purse Charm. Purse Charm Keychain. Spotty Kitty. With like a... Chinese coin in his mouth. He is missing. Well, I know he's missing one because there's one in the bottom of the, the thingy. See? I'll have to find out where that one goes. So, yeah. I just hope everybody stays safe. I hope I stay safe. I hope they stay safe. I'm a skier. And I know everybody's like, no, don't worry, it'll be fine. Well, you don't know that. You don't know that it won't be. Either, so, I guess. I'm just a glass half empty kind of person, I guess. What do we have here? Ooh, this is pretty. This is a Miriam Haskell. <laughs> it's French Jet. It's a Miriam Haskell. It is for an updo. Uh-huh. Because look at that pretty little clasp. And then you have the Miriam tag. And then you have all of these little... Little guys all the way around. That is for your updo. Yes. And your little black dress. And they have... The longer ones have um, little rondelles at the top. So it's long, short, long, short. Ooh, that's nice. That's so very nice. I'll have to look that up and see when that one's from. We're at 27. And this goes. This is. Red Jasper. Brecciated Red Jasper. And another type of, like an agate. Because this is translucent. So the big beads are agates, and the little beads are jaspers. It looks like a hand-done thing. Nice. Ooh. What are you? Wood. Looks like boulder opal. Abalone. Boulder opal. Abalone boulder opal. That's different. I do not see mark on it anywhere, but it looks like sterling. Looks like sterling to me. I don't know. We shall see. Here is uh, Angeline. San Francisco, oh, no, San, yeah, San Francisco, California cable car, Angeline, it's a Spidel, I'll bet you, no, it doesn't say Spidel on it, <laughs> well, that could be bird off of there, here's one of these guys, with a little mother of pearl, um, Plumeria, very cool, Here's a, wow, it's a crazy frog, it's a lariat, it's not a lariat, it's a, it's a bolo, oh look, this one comes off, and you can put it on another thing if you want, that's so cute, very cool, I don't see a name on it though. That's surprising. 
must be vintage because it feels really nice. Here's the popcorn chain. Popcorn chain is very difficult. Oh look, it has a little ooh medallion cross. That's rough. Laser cut. Okay. And then here's another big chain and another couple of big chains and then this big chain um this one is a what do they call it panther link it's got a v in the front um here's a really cool copper guy with sliced agate look at that that is really cool that is definitely vintage. And then not last but not least, here's a jade. Hunk of jade. Yeah. And that one says Avon, so it may or may not be real jade. And the last thing in the box, in this particular bit of this box, look at that. That's adorable. If you wait tables, that would be a fun one to have. So, we're going to leave it here. I'm going to ask that you like, subscribe, leave a comment in the down there. Because I love answering your comments. Please stay safe out there. Remember that I love you. And be yourself, because everyone else is taken.